How did the downfall of the iPhone begin? Whenever something fails, there is no certain reason for that, whether it be a plan or a well-known company. Today, we will be talking about the downfall of the iPhone. It sounds unrealistic, but believe me, it's true. So in this video, we will be talking about the main reason which led to the downfall of the iPhone. Apple is slowing down the old iPhones. Oh God, can you believe you bought an Apple iPhone and it starts to slow down? You rush to an Apple store and in response, the shopkeeper tells you, oh, there is nothing wrong with the phone. It's done by the company itself. Like what the hell is up with Apple people? But sadly, it's true. To encourage people to buy new launches, Apple slowed down the older phones. Why does Apple slow down old iPhones? Many customers had suspected that their iPhones had slowed down. In 2017, the corporate confirmed it did hamper some models as they aged, but did not encourage people to upgrade. It said the lithium-ion batteries within the devices became less capable of supplying peak current demands as they aged over time. That could result in an iPhone unexpectedly shutting down to protect its electronic components. So, it released a software update for the iPhone 6, iPhone 6S, and iPhone SE, which smoothed out battery performance. The practice was confirmed after a customer shared performance tests on Reddit, suggesting their iPhone 6S had bogged down considerably because it had aged, but had suddenly sped up again after the battery had been replaced. But don't worry, guys. Karma played her role here as well. Apple has been fined 25 million euros for intentionally slowing down older iPhone models without telling it to customers. iPhone cannot connect to Wi-Fi. After updating to iOS 11, users complain their iPhone does not connect to their personal Wi-Fi network. The initial solution is to restart your iPhone and check the Wi-Fi connection. Make sure that the router is functioning fine and is updated to the latest firmware. It should also support Apple products. If the matter isn't resolved, try connecting to Wi-Fi after attempting Reset Network Settings under iPhone Settings. However, if these fixes don't cause success, upgrade to a more modern version or restore an earlier version. iPhone users face various types of problems when they update to new iOS, transfer data from old to new iPhone, jailbreak, or launch any new app on their device. There can be many reasons for iPhone problems from hardware-software related to even some bug in iOS which just needs to be fixed. Here we compiled for you 21 commonest iPhone problems and their fixes. iPhone White Screen of Death Failed upgrade, jailbreak, or hardware problem can cause iPhone white screen of death. You can restart the device. If that fails to resolve the issue, hard reset your phone. If hard reset 2 doesn't work, boot your phone in DFU mode. But remember, both hard reset and booting in DFU mode will clear all of your settings and data on the iPhone. If you confront a situation where your iPhone is stuck at white screen and you do not have iCloud or iTunes backup, then first recover your complete data through Stellar Recovery for iPhone. Next, fix the iPhone white screen with hard reset or DFU mode. iPhone speaker not working. If you do not hear sound from your iPhone, first make sure the device isn't on silent mode, the quantity button is all up, and Bluetooth is turned off. If you continue to not hear or hear a distorted sound, open any app that has music and set the quantity with the slider or volume button. You can also restart your device as restarting resolves many phone issues. If none works, the matter might be of hardware. Your iPhone speaker must get replaced or repaired. iPhone Bluetooth Problem Failed Bluetooth connection or unable to pair your iPhone with a Bluetooth device is another common iPhone problem. The initial simple hack is to go to the settings, turn off and then on the Bluetooth and restart your device. You can also toggle airplane mode. If this does not fix the issue, go to settings, Bluetooth, select forget this device and then again try to pair it. Updating to the newer iOS version also often solves the problem. iPhone Error 53 iPhone models which have fingerprint scanners often face Error 53. It occurs when users attempt to restore their device via iTunes and therefore the device fails the safety test by Apple. Fix the Error 53 by restoring your iPhone to the latest iOS version. iPhone X screen becomes unresponsive in weather. Several incidents of iPhone X screen not responding in weather are reported by the users in colder countries, although Apple has announced to soon launch a software update to repair the difficulty. Till then, try locking and unlocking the iPhone because it has helped some to resolve the difficulty. Apps won't add iOS 11. You updated to iOS 11, but the apps won't work? 
Apple has switched from 32-bit to 64-bit apps with iOS 11, so all the 32-bit apps will refuse to figure on your device. Check under Settings which of your applications are obsolete. Tap on the 32-bit app to go to the App Store. Check if the app features a newer version and update available. If not, then sadly there's not much you'll do about it. Just delete the 32-bit applications from your iPhone and doubtless search for alternatives of comparable applications. iPhone Applications Freezes Unexpectedly An iPhone app can freeze while using or simply after launching it. It might be probably because your iOS version doesn't support the app or the app isn't properly installed on your device. If any iPhone app freezes, stops responding or unexpectedly quits, close the app, restart your device and again check if the app is functioning. Sometimes reinstalling the newest version of the app from the App Store also resolves the iPhone issue. iPhone Stuck on Apple Logo There are often several reasons for your iPhone to be stuck on the Apple logo like jailbreak of iPhone, failed iOS update, during retrieval of knowledge from backup, hardware problems, deletion of some iOS files, etc. You can fix the difficulty by restarting the iPhone, doing hard reset, or putting the device in recovery mode. Remember, hard reset results in complete data loss from your iPhone. You'll restore lost data from the backup, else take refuge in an iPhone data recovery solution. Forgot iPhone passcode or iPhone disabled Yes, you'll forget your iPhone passcode. As a result, you create several attempts trying to unlock your device. Your iPhone gets disabled asking to retry after 5, 10, 20 minutes and so on. To unlock your disabled iPhone, reset the device and set a replacement passcode. Erase the old passcode by restoring the iPhone through iTunes or iCloud. You'll also use the recovery mode to repair disabled iPhone. The process to repair disabled iPhone results in complete data loss, including all the passwords, photos, videos, music, Safari bookmarks, contacts, apps, camera roll, chats, etc. Thus, recovering all data from iCloud backup or use the iPhone recovery software before troubleshooting the matter. iTunes Error 3194 You encounter iTunes Error 3194 when trying to revive or upgrade your iPhone. It is often either due to the wrong firmware version, the iOS version that you simply aren't installing isn't approved by Apple, or you are employing a jailbreak utility to upgrade the iPhone. However, this will be fixed by making changes within the host files of your system. You'll also do factory reset to repair iTunes Error 3194. Just in case of knowledge loss and absence of backup, take help of Stellar Data Recovery for iPhone to recover all lost data. iPhone Black Screen Dropping your iPhone, spilling water thereon, updating an app, malware, bad firmware, jailbreak, etc. might be the explanation for iPhone Black Screen. To fix the difficulty, first begin with charging your iPhone completely to rule out any battery issue. If the matter persists, restore your iPhone to factory settings via iTunes, but this also results in iPhone data loss. If you do not have a backup, then consider a Stella data recovery for iPhone to recover your lost photos, videos, music, messages, chats, contacts, etc. from the device. So these were a few reasons for the downfall of the iPhone. What do you think about it? Are you an Android lover or iOS lover? Let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Let us know your views in the comment section below. Until the next video, stay tuned and subscribe to our channel for more uploads like this. Also, if you're not subscribed yet, then do it now.